Yeah. Well, I just got your sheets back here. Hey! So what is it, like bronchitis, pneumonia, or... Um, yeah, it's, it's just not good. It's what? It's pretty bad. It's, it's lung cancer. I'm sorry. Huh. What? But it's, it's, he doesn't smoke. He hasn't smoked a day in his life. How can he have lung cancer? It's, it's, it was his wife. What? She, you know, oh, don't you blame smoke. my dead mother on this. Hey, she's been dead for 10 years. And I was it, her it, doctor. Okay. And you know what she has? It's the okay. same thing. That doesn't mean she gave it to him. Cancer <coughs> can hate smoke. It. And seeing as how it's been 10 years, obviously, it took some time. It takes more time for secondhand smoke to affect someone than just smoking. I'm a doctor, you gotta trust me. Um, is there, like, did you get, like, second opinion? Did, can we, or, like? I asked, I asked Joe, he, 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 he said the exact same thing. It, the, the test was conclusive. There was, there's nothing else. Okay, exactly how serious, <coughs> how serious is this lung cancer? Like, is how, it? It, it, it's serious. Like, how long Very. has he got left? If it is it terminal? Well, can you tap it may him be on terminal that? if we could treat it, but his Medicaid's gone. Wait, my insurance should be fine. That's the thing. It it is. This is a pre um, pre existing condition. Is what they said. Cool. So either Pre-existing. you're going to pay out of pocket, or just not get it at all. <coughs> Pre-existing? How is this pre-existing? That's what they said. I, I don't, I'm not the one who did it, okay? If, if it were up to me, well, how much, I would give you the key. How much is this going to cost to, to, to fix Dad? About... I'm not too sure. Let me just be right back. I'm going to talk to, talk to the Dr. Joe. Like, hey, exactly. You two, no. Exactly. You two are not selling the house. <coughs> oh, we, oh, you can't. We can't, oh, we can't just let you no. die. Yeah. Yeah. No. The house is... What are we gonna do if we you're can't live in Grandma's? It's no big deal. Happy life. No, you haven't. You're 45. <laughs> I did a lot of stuff in those years. <laughs> would you like to live another 40 years? It would be nice. Well, to then see my sell the house. But it's no, not that big of a deal. It, no, I cannot do that to you two. Well, I <coughs> with um, it's it's pretty high. It's about 42,000. How much is the house worth? Uh, Oh, no, I think last time <coughs> we had appraised was about thirty-six. Okay, so if we sold that, we could <coughs> do well. I, I don't know. Right I mean, the housing market is pretty bad now. So trying to sell the house <laughs> is not going to. Ha- I mean, Thank you. I'm not trying to be a negative Nancy. We could, we could I'm just being realistic. That's true. We could. There's plenty <coughs> of there's plenty of of ways to get money. I mean, uh, you two, you dumb fine. Your mom would be proud. But you're... We can't just let you die, Dad. What? What? No. It will be fine. No, it won't be fine. <coughs> well, like, I just don't want you two sacrificing. Well, how, long, how long does it... How long do we have to, to, to raise the money? Well, about, like, I'd say six months before. It's just there's no way of turning it around. <laughs> so, six months. Six months. And you're you're sure you can you run another test just to be sure? Like, I've run as many tests as I can. This is this is it. This there were no more tests to run. They were all the exact same. Is it is it both lungs? Could you just take one out and he'd be okay? That doesn't work that way. I'm sorry. In fact, John Wayne, when he was dying of lung cancer, he said, screw this, just take out both my lungs. <coughs> and still, he's still dead, though. Because you just can't get rid of one lung and hope for the best. Both lungs are bad. I mean, it's, it's, it's just terrible. Come on, Dad. If we mortgage the house, we can earn another $10,000 somehow. Exactly. I don't want you to sacrifice it. Well, if you if you die, are we gonna be sacrificing? What are we gonna do without you? You're you're the only the only one we have left. If you're gone, it's just it's just me and Cat. 
You we can, can we can just mortgage the house. We'll come up with another right. two thousand dollars. Alright. <coughs> How's this? We will look into mortgaging the house. And we'll find and we'll see if this is possible. And then we'll make a decision. That way we're not rushing <coughs> and we're not panicking on anything. Okay. What do we do if we can't if we can't complete? <coughs> how long does he have left? Maybe three, four years. I mean, could be even longer. Could be even six years if 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 he's a trooper. And I think he could be. Six years. Yeah. But you could just you could do it without the money. Like <coughs> theoretically, you wouldn't. We wouldn't have to pay you to do it. Like, the money's not going to do it. You could go in there and fix him, right? Well, we could fix him, but the thing is, is that I get I get yelled at from my boss. I mean, it's, it's hell. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Would you, would you like me hey, to yell at hey, you? Hey. Okay. No, okay. No. I've tried many things, and the fact that, you know, I'm working in, like, a clinic in Bowling Green, of all places, it just shows that <coughs> I've done a lot of things to, you know, help people, but it just... It doesn't help you, my career to help other Doctor, people. Doctor, thank you for what you've done. Thank okay. you for... I <coughs> know this. All right. Um, uh, are there any alternative treatments to this? Or is it... Like, what treatments are there for this? Well, <coughs> there's the chemo, which is 42,000. Yeah. But, I mean... Yeah, I don't... There's... Else. What's what's the chances with the chemo? Is that a guaranteed fix? There's never such thing as a guaranteed fix when well, it comes to cancer. How? Oh, percentage wise? Chances? Yeah. It's it's okay. more than half, but it's it's not. Okay. I'd say maybe a seven something. That'd be something. Okay. Okay. <coughs> How's this? We'll go home. Talk about what to do, and not take up any more time from this. Can we have like a phone number or something so we can call you or your office if we have more questions? Oh yeah, sure. Hey, thank him. Thank you. Thanks for necessary. Thank you. I I don't deserve your thanks. All I've done is told you that you don't have much long to live. Yes, but at least we know now. Thank you. Just, just make the best of what time you have. Thanks. I mean, you could have six years. I mean, go for it. Live your life to the fullest. I have to check on another patient. Um, I got a light bulb stuck up his ass. Sorry. Hey, All right, Mr. Lynch. At least I don't have a light bulb stuck up my ass. <laughs> wow, Dad. You know, I think I think the light bulb would be preferable in this situation. Yeah. I don't know. I think I'd be quite uncomfortable. Yeah, you know what? Okay. Not okay. You're, oh, you're right. Come there. on. Yeah, I, uh, smile. It could be. It's not the worst thing. What? Well, okay. What's the worst thing, Dad? I could be in pain. <laughs> it could be agony. It could be. I could be bleeding out somewhere. It, trust me. There are far worse things, and I've lived a happy life. I mean, I had your mother, I have you two. <coughs> uh, don't worry, and we'll, I'll fight this. We'll, we'll figure something out. All right? You two don't worry about me. Come on. <coughs> Let's get you two ice cream or something. That always made you happy, oh, I think. I want a milkshake. <laughs> okay. All right. Milkshake, you? <sighs> milkshake, too. Okay, milkshake. On me. Come on. See? <laughs> that was a costume, Joey. Milkshake. That was really good. That was a good dad. Thank you. really good. Fun, dude.